Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Ryan Saplin here, Fat Loss Strength Coach, coming to you today with another Fat Loss Strength Tip. And um, simple, attitude. Attitude really is everything. It's pretty difficult to have a bad attitude. Well, it's difficult to have to feel bad and have a bad attitude. Or if better yet, if you have a crappy attitude, if you if you have a if you feel like crap but you really focus on trying to improve your attitude, it's gonna change your outlook on things. I know that a lot of people out there depending on your background and opinions or whatnot, you might be kind of a half as glass empty or half as glass full. As a general rule, if you focus on having a half as glass full approach, you're generally gonna feel better about yourself and when you feel better about yourself, you're gonna do better. Now I know this sounds like foo-foo, sprinkles and sunshine and unicorns, but realize that you are in full control about how you feel and how you respond to how you feel. Sometimes, I'll actually say this, the truth is, Sometimes you don't, you don't have, a compl that's actually bullshit, because the truth is you really, sometimes when you feel like crap, you feel like crap. I'm just going to be totally honest with you. And sometimes you're just not going to be in the mood. And I'm, what can I say? You know, I'm just being as honest as I possibly can, being very genuine in this video, is that you, the best thing you can really do is work on your attitude. I know it sounds stupid and might sound a little silly, but you have to work on something because if you don't do anything, you're just going to waste away like everybody else. Uh, I think that's, I mean, just think about where you work. If you don't work like in a fitness environment and you work in a sort of like an, a sedentary life, how many people are overweight? You know, how many people don't go to the gym? How many people don't exercise? Look, you are watching this video. I don't know where you are watching this video, but you're watching this video because you're looking to get some motivation, you're looking to get some advice, you're looking for something to get you to move faster and closer to where you want to go. And I hope this video helps you. Realize that, look, with negative attitudes or feeling negative, it's normal. If you feel that way, you just have to question whether or not it's legitimate to have those feelings. And that's not always easy. Um, I deal with a lot of negativity in my own head. And I'm learning, and, I, and over the course of the many years, I've learned how to manage it. And the way you manage it is simply talking to yourself. It sounds, it sounds crazy, but you know, a lot of times the way we feel, why we feel bad, sad, and depressed about our weight loss or our strength is because we don't allow, we are irrational. We make things worse than they are. And they're not worse than they are. They are just not good. You know, we make something worse than it is. And a lot of times, too, when something is going well, we make it better than it is. And it's being able to find that neutral ground in the middle that makes the biggest thing. And you can only get that from self-awareness. But even with self-awareness, being aware of how realistic a situation is, traumatic or whatnot, you can still be as positive as you can. So that way it helps you versus hurts you. Um, anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Click like if you haven't already. Hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're not a subscriber. And if you're not on my email list yet, click the link up here. Get a free gift from me just for subscribing. You can always unsubscribe. There's also a link probably down here. If you're on mobile, click the link in the description. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys all on the next video.